This cheese stands alone. It's actually it's not me, it's not them, it's actually that cheese right there. That is a big wheel of aged Gouda, courtesy of our friends at the Arethusa Farm in Litchfield. Uh, I want you to say, to, uh, say hi to Tony Urgaitis and Chris Cassiello. Tony's the, the big cheese over at Arethusa, right? Is uh, that, that, does it say that on your well, business cards? Well, you can say that. Okay. You say no, no, you're, you, right. you're the big guy. Right. You could say whatever you well, want. Because right, sure. <laughs> yes. he's paying the bills. <laughs> and, and, Chris, and Chris is the big cheese maker. Yeah, head so, cheese maker, plant manager. Nice to see you both. Thank you. I'll get to you in a second. We'll get into the right. ins and outs. But you guys, Arethus is very well known for their dairy. Lots of great stuff. And we'll talk about that in a second. But cheese, you've been in business for how long? 2011. Okay. So in 12 years, you went from just making some cheese to making the big cheese. How do you, you know, how does that feel? Or, or are you surprised that, that you're, you're getting this kind of accolade? Uh, kind of have to uh, pinch ourselves. Mm -hmm. I mean, I was really surprised when we uh, received Best of Show mm -hmm. out of uh, 2,300 entries. W right. And that was amazing. That is, that's no small right. feat. Right. Absolutely. That's, See that's, what, uh, yeah. Let's 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 see what Chris has to say about it because you've been there for the whole twelve years, twelve thirteen years. Yeah, almost fourteen years. Now, How yeah. do you, what do you do as a cheese maker to to kind of? Tweak it a little bit, make it better. How do you how do you get to the yeah, top? Yeah, so I mean, it starts with great milk. Uh -huh. We have great milk here in Connecticut. Sure. Great dairies. That's, right. that's uh -huh. our first thing. Right. Uh -huh. And then it's uh, subtle changes yeah. as you go. Little subtle changes takes a long time to age out cheese. You know, the award-winning cheese was. Uh, 20 months old. Right. So, uh, and, and, and there it is right now. Let's get it. I want to get a close up and then we'll, we'll taste it in a moment. So, take a look. That, that, how big is that wheel right there? That's about 18 pounds. 18 pounds. Okay. Yeah. When you are making the cheese, how many uh, 18 pound wheels do you we make? We make about uh, 25 wheels. Okay. At a whack. Yeah. Do you know you've got something really good or do you find out when you taste it? When you cut you, it? Uh, we taste it at certain intervals, mm -hmm. you know, three months, six months, 12 months, and then we kind of steer it, see which ones are steering the right way. Right. And, and what, what gave you the indication that we got a, a contender here? Well, it was just uh, it was just getting better and better. Uh -huh. You know, uh, the Gouda style cheeses start out with really blank canvas, and uh -huh. they, uh, there's a uh, character just builds and builds. Right. And so we uh, we saw that it was going the right way and uh, and held it back. Tony, you do a whole bunch of. The different cheeses here. We've got a couple of them. I'm going to very right. delicately lift this so you can see. Right. You've got what looks like a, a little Edom over there, and you got what is this? Uh, uh, that's Crybaby. Cry that's a Swiss style. A Swiss? Camembert. Camembert. Cam okay. Uh, but this is. But the, what yep. you see at the top of the bottom right now. That's your aged Gouda. Uh, yes. What What makes it a good Gouda? Um, a good Gouda is mm -hmm. uh, is got uh, subtle characteristics. It's uh, uh, mild, mm -hmm. but it's got a ton of flavor, right. brothy, very, very uh, sweet, uh, nutty. Uh, there's some uh, fruit notes in there. Mm -hmm. You get the tyrosine crystals. There's a protein crystal that forms over right. time. Mm -hmm. um, Tony, you were almost like mouthing the words when oh, you were saying my it. What did he mean? Right. No, well, uh, it's first when ju uh, you know the team of judges. They mm -hmm. it's, it's visual first. Absolutely. They use all the senses. Uh, coloration is very important. Uh, of course, you know the aroma is Which extremely is important. important before and you even taste it. You look at it. And, and that's kind of what I did wrong just now. I just oh, grabbed the right. piece and, well, I, and I didn't even... Not, there's, right. nothing wrong. there's a right. whole bunch to this, oh, isn't right. there? So right. how do you feel, boss? How do I feel? Yeah. Well, you got the big cheese, the big, big Gouda. cheese, mm -hmm. and uh, don't be intimidated. Mm -hmm. because <laughs> big cheese. Mm -hmm. uh, just mm -hmm. love to, you know. It's he's just uh, great. He just the, makes us want to like, work do, harder. And now I'm gonna, and that's a great way to, to toss it back to Chris. How do you improve on greatness? Oh, we, chief, we just uh, are going to be consistent. You know, mm -hmm. we've got a, a bunch of other cheeses in the lineup that we're working on, and, mm -hmm. and they're, they're, they're winning national awards, too. So, um, you know, it's, it's uh, steer the course. And uh, By the way, in case you didn't notice, they have lots of stuff we're showing you right now, everything from the milks and the ice cream. They have their dairies. You have uh, two of them. You have one up, up there by you, and one in New Haven as well. Fairfield yep. as well? Uh, West Hartford. West Hartford is the other yep. one. Of and course. Main, How the flagship Hartford? store in Bantam. And the ice cream that I've had, it is delicious. Yeah. But the ice cream you can push to the side because it's the cheese. The cheese is pretty good. Congratulations, boss. Thank you. And and I uh, listen, right. I'm gonna come work for you if the you know when, when the weather you. thing is done. Because right. if if you pay in cheese, I'm I'm good. <laughs>